Blockchain is the future. Oh, it's actually the present. 2022 is going to be the year of Web3. Uh, ignoring whether it's true or false, let's look at it from the perspective of an engineer. If you are an engineering student who is graduating in upcoming years and you are not learning how to implement these technologies, then you are missing out something very, very interesting to learn. So please watch the video till the end and we are going to tell you everything that you need to know in order to become a Blockchain Web3 developer. Hey guys, this is Achinte Gomath. In this video, we are going to discuss a zero to hero roadmap in order to become a blockchain web3 developer. So in this video, we are going to discuss what is blockchain, uh, a basic definition 30 seconds. I will explain you what is blockchain, what is web3. And then we are going to understand what are the prerequisites, what are the top skills that you need to have in order to become a blockchain developer. Then I will tell you some free resources, some tutorials that you can follow in order to learn these skills that we have discussed. Then we'll talk about 20 plus project ideas that you can make. Most of these project ideas are with free tutorials on YouTube and along with the source code which you can take ideas from. After that, we will talk about how you can make money in this domain and we'll talk about how you can apply for jobs and internships. So this is going to be a very helpful video. Please watch till the end. Before we start the video, I would like to make a humble request. Please like the video. We are taking a like target of 500 like you help us achieve all our like target. Please like this video as well so that more and more students are able to watch this content and subscribe to the channel as well. If you haven't done so far, at least 40 to 45 percent students don't subscribe to our videos. So please subscribe to the channel as well. Okay, so let's start by what is blockchain. You must have seen lots of videos online. I will try to explain the very basic concept in less than 30 seconds. Take an example of currency. In India, it is rupees, which is managed by RBI. All the, all the decisions related to it is taken by RBI, like how much to be printed, what will be its value, which is legal, which is illegal, which is uh, fraud, which is genuine. So what blockchain does, like the decision will not be taken by single authority, it will be taken by thousands and millions of decisive devices. So this is the simple concept of blockchain where you take the uh, control from one central authority and given to thousands and thousands of devices on the basis of some logic, some principles, some rule. <laughs> so that is the basic concept of blockchain. Now what is Web3? So cryptocurrency, you must have heard the application of blockchain concept in the domain of currency is called cryptocurrency that is known by cryptocurrency and you must have heard about bitcoins, you must have dodgy coins and many coins you must have heard of. When you apply the concept of blockchain in the domain of web, uh, website, internet, it is called web3. So you must have heard about web1, web2. In web1, there was just like text, you can send emails, you can show images, etc. In web2, there were dynamic features like you can play a video, you can play game, animations, etc. There was all the social media was built in web2. In web3, the web3 is going to be decentralized based on Ethereum, blockchains, etc. So this is the web3, the very basic definition. You don't have to understand everything at this moment. You are just beginning your journey in the blockchain. As more and more you learn about it, you will get more idea about it. I'm explaining to you in a very simplified manner. It's a very complex term. Okay, as more and more you study about it and you are going to learn. So don't worry, chinta mat karo, jiri jiri sab So now we are going to talk about the prerequisites and the tool that you are going to need in order to become a blockchain developer. So you have two options. You can either go via JavaScript or Python. I would recommend to go via JavaScript because you will get lots of community support and tools. Okay, you can also go via Python. This video is via JavaScript only. Okay, so uh, for beginnings, you must have some basic knowledge of JavaScript. You must have made some small application. You must know about DOM manipulation, how to create functions. ES6 is the latest variant of JavaScript. You must be aware about there are a few more updations as well, but e ES6 is the most important one, which you must be aware about. So first thing that you need to know for blockchain is solidity. Uh, Solidity is a language you can say which is used to make blockchains and specifically you have to write a smart contracts using Solidity. So we are going to talk about how you are going to learn it, but it is what you need to know. You can use IDE called Remix IDE, like there is VS Code for web development and other things. There is IDE called Remix IDE. Apart from this, there is Truffle Suite. It is a, a framework which helps you to deploy your uh, blockchain or internet and in anywhere else. Within it, there is a, a thing called Ganache. It is a very small local uh, blockchain that you can deploy in order to test your blockchain, whether it's working or not. So you can learn about it as well. I've added tutorials in the next section so solidity is basically for the backend part of your uh, blockchain device like what is the logic is going to be on the backend for the front end you have to use multiple frameworks you can either use react js uh, or you can use angular js view js whichever you want to use depending on your need of your project so you can choose react or angular what you want but the most commonly used is react js so you can learn that as well but there is a specific 
tool which is framework library which is sorry <laughs> it is a library web 3 js which is very commonly used it has lot of methods functions uh, which you can apply in order to make web 3 js uh, web 3 application as well as blockchain so we are going to talk about it in details how to deploy there is ethereum virtual machine you can use you can use mainnet it is like aws for blockchain you can also use aws for blockchain but it's better to use a specific uh, dedicated tool which is called ethereum virtual machine or mainnet you are going to learn about it at a later phase of your blockchain learning journey so don't worry about it virtual machine is a uh, machine which is dedicated to deploy your blockchain so you can uh, allocate resources to it you can create endpoints through which it can communicate to outer world so all these things you can provide mainnet is to deploy when it is finally ready apart from this you have to use some gateway the meta mask is a wallet with which you can uh, connect with other ethereum if you want to make some transactions etc so you have to study about meta mask as well it is very important if you want to make some crypto related applications in your blockchain definitely you would want to make it so definitely learn how to may use metamask i have added tutorial as well additionally you can study about cryptography how cryptography works it will definitely uh, increase your knowledge ether scan is it's a tracker it's like helps you debug like where how your transactions are moving how data is moving from one node to another it's an additional thing that you want to uh, can learn hard hat is another IDE. it's an alternative to remix if you want to use you can use you can compare another alternative is brownie so these are the two three options of IDE. you can start with remix IDE with a very beginner level hard hat is slightly complex when you become a pro then you can switch to it uh, apart from this there are many other JS frameworks like there are so many JS frameworks like for everything there is a JS framework that's why I recommended you to go for JavaScript instead of Python so some of them are next JS ether JS so you are going to use some of them depending upon your application in which domain you are making what kind of functionalities you want to create so let's look at some free resources that you can use first is you have to study solidity i have added two three types of resources first is the introduction video like what is solidity what all you have to study next is a free code camp video it's a four five hour long video next is a code eater tutorial it's in hindi you can watch next is eat the blocks 29 videos like five minutes seven minutes small video whole playlist you can watch next is a sahil agrawal 27 videos in hindi you can watch next is a dap university tutorials you can watch so dap university moralis web3 free code camp code eater code the block so these are the very common youtube channels that you can follow if you want to study anything regarding blockchain next you have to study about truffle so you can follow these two videos i have mentioned then you can study about web3 js two videos i have mentioned you can study about them with the help of them or you can study from any other resource if you want to you can also follow some courses on coursera udemy etc uh, you can easily find their name from youtube etc but i was i wanted to give you some free resources and some courses on udemy are free some are paid some are on uh, sale sometimes so i'm not sure when they are free or not uh, next you study how to deploy your blockchain on ethereum mainnet so videos there of dap university then there is an introduction of metamask uh, one video is of introduction second is how to you can integrate with your uh, blockchain next is a video on cryptography and next is a video on ether scan so apart from this you can explore a lot of resources but the best learning can only happen when you yourself implement those things next we talk about 20 plus project ideas that you can make so in this initially i have added very basic ideas that you can make uh, hello world in ethereum metamask dapp so dapp is nothing but decentralized application so simple applications are called applications decentralized applications are called dapp application which are based on the concept of blockchain so basic applications you can make you can check the tutorials you can check the source code in the description most of the videos will be having the source code if any of them is not having so please let me know in the comments and i will update the link to some other tutorials okay next is the to-do list you can create a basic to-do list on the basis of concept of ethereum third is five beginner level dApps you can create uh, fourth is how you can create a login app okay fifth you can create a game uh, next is a voting system it's a very famous application of blockchain you can apply in your college projects in your internship etc this is a very good project that you can make you can also look for different uh, tutorials for this as well so this is very difficult it took me a very long time to find it uh, then you can make youtube clone instagram clone so this is will these two will be your proper web3 projects how you can create a web2 application and convert it into a web3 project okay next is a cryptocurrency app like you can create your own cryptocurrency like bitcoin and etc OpenSea NFT marketplace. OpenSea is a famous NFT marketplace, so you can create a clone of it using blockchain and Web3 uh, utilities. 
chat app chat based application a decentralized chat application which will not be working on any centralized server it will be working on the server of those uh, devices on which chat is happening reddit clone using morales morales is the web framework it's like a web3 frameworks uh, on which you can create your own application so it will be based on that so it is not on default uh, web3 or blockchain it is on basis of this platform only so if you want to make you can watch the tutorial or you can or you can check other tutorial as well for the same topic crypto punk clone it's also a very famous website you can definitely check the tutorial and make it supply chain logistic this is a very detailed tutorials there is just two videos this is the link to one video and in the description of this you can check the second video as well you will see a detailed video on this a uh, very experienced person has created this tutorial so you can make it as a major project in your college final year internship etc so these are the 15 tutorials i found on internet with tutorials apart from this i have added some ideas that you can make like carpooling crowd funding system document storage real estate healthcare and you can think of endless ideas okay and if you are thinking like these are common ideas so what you can do you can make them get some idea like how to implement a functionality and then take these code blocks and make some unique idea of your own because if you are making some idea of your own then you will not know like login kaise karu hai na data kaise store karau crud operations kaise karau aapko ye sab samajh mein nahi aayega to aap kya karo ye project bana lo inme se samajh lo ki kaise login karana hai kaise database karana hai aur fir apne unique idea mein inko implement kar do okay so these are the ideas you can make if you have any other ideas let us know in the comment section now we talk about how to make money okay so first you have to do you have to do all the prerequisites go through all the tutorials go through all the projects at least 3 to 4 projects you must make and then you think about how to make money first freelancing or you can contribute to open source gitcoin is a very good open source community that you can uh, contribute to you can check out the website and there are many ways you can contribute you can go to the discord server they can go to the github repos etc you can check out the discussion forums and everything will be available to you they are running like bounties like you will be given some task like please find bug here do this functionality do that feature if you do that you will be given some price in some dollars and etc so you can follow that you can trade in cryptos and nfts i will not recommend that but this is also one way to make money lot of students are doing that and they are making lot of money it's very risky so please get do it under advice of some senior adult or anyone you know who is a professional hackathons this is a very unique and a uh, different way of doing earning money in this so you can check out dev post hacker link eth global these are the three platform on which you can participate on hackathons and win a good amount of money you can check out their websites and explore them in details you can also check out some communities on discord uh, this these are the website links of these uh, web uh, these communities and you can find the discord invite link on their websites okay uh, figment.io build space quest book so these are the three website you can visit and join the discord community for up updates regarding internship opportunity hackathons etc now we talk about how to get a job and internship in blockchain and web3 domain currently there aren't many job and internship but you will see in next one year and two year there will be lot of opportunity if you are in second year and third year then this is the best time to do so also if you there are not job and internship but projects done in this domain will get a lot of weightage than project done in a normal web development or android okay so you can definitely make project and even if you don't get a job and internship directly so first option is cryptocurrency job it is a portal which list global opportunities in blockchain domain okay so you can check out this portal register a uh, So, uh, you can apply on all the opportunities and sign up for their updates on email and etc next is the eth global discord server you can join that build space discord server you can join that chain link discord server you can join that and apart from that you will get opportunities on angel list angel.co linkedin linkedin etc <laughs> not link list okay so these are the common ways where you can find opportunities related to that I hope I have given you all the information that you need to know. If you have some queries, you can definitely comment in the comment section. Or किसके लिए बना होता है comment section? So please comment. And if you have any other query apart from any other development, any other roadmap, so please let us know. You can join the link of WhatsApp group in the description so that you can stay connected and get all the latest update about our community.